Greece is uh, an all-time classic destination and of course the tourism offering in the higher end is improving uh, year by year and this is one of the aims of the Greek Ministry of uh, Tourism to improve both the infrastructure and the services and therefore uh, really uh, be able to um, attract more uh, sophisticated and discerning customers. This year we had so many uh, private jets wanting to land in the regional airports of Greece so we really want to be able to uh, meet that demand and this is why we're also trying to promote all those more uh, sophisticated and small boutique hotels in Greece. There are so many places in Greece uh, with uh, unique uh, uh, products, uh, with wineries, uh, where you can have a totally different experience uh, than you know, in, in other places. Uh, we aim to attract visitors year-round, uh, so not only for sea and sun, but for all sorts of experiences, uh, and especially the niche markets such as uh, the uh, golf tourism market or the yachting, uh, and also you know relaxation such as uh, wellness and spa, uh, and also activities in the nature and all sorts of uh, experiences uh, uh, that Greece offers everywhere in all its destinations. We have uh, so many uh, new facilities in Crete the island where I come from, which combines both contemporary lifestyle but also gives you the opportunity to explore uh, the more genuine and authentic experience uh, in the villages. Um, so I think that overall Greece is making a very big comeback and this is why we're trying to promote not only the well-known destinations but also the new destinations in Greece. Two thousand and thirteen was a record year. Two thousand and fourteen was a new record year. Uh, we see that the trend is again um, uh, very positive for two thousand and fifteen. Greece is not only a classic destination, but also everywhere you go in Greece, there is a correlation with a myth, a hero, a god, uh, a story from ancient times. So I think that this is actually very fascinating. Mount Olympus really exists, and one can go there and have. Uh, amazing experiences skiing or hiking or uh, visiting the uh, Temple of Zeus. So it's really fascinating to be able to go where things started and where hospitality was born. <laughs>